When I came to North Texas, it was it was just right. When you meet the legendary mean Joe Green, he's got some great stories about his days at the University of North Texas, like the one about the first time he met his football coaches. And before I went into the office, I went down to, I excused myself and went to the restroom and did some push-ups. <laughs> you know, I was to always... To look a little bigger? Yeah, a little bit swell bigger. Swell up? Swell up. And then there's the story about how UNT actually became the home of the mean green. It was because of his performance at a game against UTEP way back in 1966. In the stands, they started to shout, not shout, but chant, Go Mean Green, you look so good to me, and it just filled the stadium. We could go on and on with stories, but those are for another day. Tonight, Mean Joe Green wants the focus on his wife. She was really, really special. And how her seven-year battle with breast cancer changed their family for the better. She saw beauty in just about everything. Even in the thick of her fight, Agnes did not give up, not even when her own son was given the dreaded news. He, too, had cancer, leukemia. She actually has t uh, said to me numerous times is that she felt like God had allowed her to continue to live in order to provide support for me. Delon's sister was a perfect bone marrow match, but mom lost her battle in 2015. She never lost hope nor her faith in God. He was the one that helped us fight that battle. He was the one that gave mom those seven perfect years and through me was able to supply healing to the lawn. <laughs> this Saturday, the Greens are holding a fundraiser to continue funding the scholarship they started in their mother's honor three years ago. It's awarded to students who have in some way been impacted by cancer. This is our way of saying, okay, we're in this battle with you and we're trying to help students who are going through this. Mean Joe Green is the face of the scholarship, but there would be no scholarship if it were not for his three children. You see, their mother always taught them to give back, and they listened. Agnes was a very giving and loving person. Mean Joe Green came to UNT on a scholarship of his own. He went on to become the greatest player in school history, where he met and married the greatest woman he's ever known. How many years did you have with her? Forty-seven and a half. Big rush on him. They Joe got him. Green. Joe Green's doing. Considered seven, not only the greatest player ever at UNT, but also one of the greatest defensive tackles in NFL history, Mean Joe Green's legacy lives on. This Hall of Famer wants you to know he didn't do it alone. What do you want the students who receive your wife's scholarship to do with it? To follow their dreams.